meeting oh, yesterday me, where they, they were Gatot mains and they're like, finally, thank you thank for validating you. us. Thank you, Omega. Now, this is a very strong pick. Liquid closes up with the, again, Eminent Ling. Uh, the Roger was out there early on. We didn't know if it was gold or jungle. Now confirmed. Benny will go ahead and scratch away in the gold lane with the link closing it up. I like it. It's very comfortable draft for Liquid, but how does it fare against Omega's venomous rattlesnake draft? I actually completely agree. Very comfortable. Coming off. Well, look at that. A triple to start. Talk about scaling. A Sanford. I don't know if he's going to do anything. Oh, Flicker in from Ryota. Ryota Army again making noise. A Zyda tries to get the oh. turtle and he steals it away. Gonna manage to escape here, but on the other hand, the two gold laners beating in the middle. The clash will not continue here, but look at this, they find someone, it's gonna be onto Chaknu. Is he still alive? No! Zyda's gonna bring him down. This turtle for the taking, or TLPH wants to answer this, there's a the conceal. There's a the conceal, but is he gonna go for the back line? Look at that, another burst right away onto Sanji as Zyda gets the turtle. Tempest of Blades is there, AOG as well. A lot of ultimates being casted, but the first man down as well as JP. Look at Sanford going in with a vengeance, is he gonna be able to escape? One more hit, but Riona says it's on. And wow, just wow, Chakno, although he used the revitalize, that all oh, look at that! <laughs> Benny Cutie chases right after Chakno, wants to go for Endoryu. That in the Lord Pit, and this is why it's so important for JP to get that implosion oh, off. Oh, final slash onto Chakno plus a Sacred Hammer. Are they gonna burst down oh. the Mamba? Mamba goes down right away, but on the other hand, Jome working on the top lane. Force or use all your resources, because at the end of the day, but wait a minute, third chapter combination for JP here. Spear of Destruction, I'm not sure if it hits, but the Demonic Force is there. Oh. Look at that, oh. Jack no soaking up all the damage, but it's not going to be enough, because Sanji's going to bring him down. Now, Better Cutie onto the back line, Sanford soaking up the damage as well, as Ryota gets the Lord, plus the kill onto Sanford. And that trade... Make a call here. They want a sandwich. Oh, but Jome catches oh. the Zyda off guard with the Unworld. Oh. And Jack, no AOG. Spare up the structure will connect. Here comes Big J. Pops the Purify. JP's going up to the damage, but here comes Benny Cutie. Oh, no. He's going up against three. The like and bounce just to bring down Big J. Manages to escape. Andoryu chasing after Benny Cutie. He has the war cry, though. So he's got the like and bounce. But Andoryu still wins the exchange. On to Zyda. Plus the Onward combination. Didn't give enough time for Zyda to cast that uh, Tempest of Blade, but right now Omega is bursting wow. down this Lord. Sanford goes in, but who okay. gets the Lord AOG once again? JP picks up a kill, plus another on to Ryota, but look at Jome getting another. Gonna get Sanford here now. TLPH on a roll. It's just Ukir and Jome. Oh, Jome. But here comes the Spear of Destruction. Jome going right after three. Oh. Get Benny Cutie, he does. Focuses on his attention on to JP. But the oh, Nightmare Spore from Zanji is there. Wow. It's the synergy with the haircuts, man. The hairstyles here between Jome and Ukir. Oh, they still have the Lord up top. And now focusing their attention onto uh -oh. the mid lane turret. Look at the damage. Even Zyda has to walk away. Okay, they still have a minion, but they get the base turret. They're happy with it, man. With the glooms forcing Zyda to use the Templates of Blaze. Spear of Destruction will connect. Will Jome enter as the Lord bursts down the turret? Look at that oh. AOG from Jack the once again. Connecting every single skills. Jome's still here, but Benny Cutie picks up a kill onto Chaknu as they burst down the Lord. Now two inhibitors. Gonna go ahead and start this Lord here, less than half health oh, right now. Oh, but Ryota catches Sanford off guard there as Jome just dishes out the damage. Ryota has to pop the Primal Wrath onto JP, soaking up every single damage, but Benny Cutie pops oh. Chaknu's immortality! But Daddy JP with the implosion play of a lifetime! Two members will fall down in exchange for Sanford. Ryota working on Benny Cutie. Chaknu does it well, but this time JP does it. And now they have the push into the base here. Working on the bottom turret. Oh, Ukir. He has to force the black shoes just to evade. But look at Sanji dealing out the DPS. Gets a kill onto Ukir. Temples of Blades for Zyda here. And now JP catches someone. It's going to be onto two. Who's going to fall down first? Ryota is low. He's going to fall down. In the hands of Benicuti. Chaknu AOG is not going to be enough. Has two members left to fend for themselves. Five members of TLP oh. still here. They don't care.
some way, Smart Omega has this defense plan, but then can they keep it together? The push still coming through from Sanji and Sanford here. It's only Andoryu for a little bit longer. Four seconds before Uki arrives, but Andoryu manages to pick one off. Oh. And now a winter crown play just to delay. Oh. No more inhibitor turrets left, but Omega still standing. Look here. Well, that said, he doesn't have Flicker, doesn't yeah. have it available, but Sanford does. And that's why they're playing up front as this Lord oh. gets ready to walk in. Implosion play from JB as they bring down Endorio. AOG is there, but Benicuity managing to free it. Every single member of Omega has to walk away, though, because of damage. He has to respect the damage of Omega as Omega tries to work on this Lord. Chak new very low here. Joel still unbothered. JB goes in with the Sacred Hammers. But Immortality is going to be popped up outside the onto the back line. Look at Benicuity. It's a hit and miss, but it's more miss than hit. All right, there's one. You protect yourself from the carry, the Edith and the Zask. What about Lolita? And then you bomb the Ling out of the sky. All right. So I guess both sides have answered, I would say, pretty appropriately. They have, I but it's soft. It's soft, yes. Right. I wouldn't say it's like full on, like you're countered. It's more of soft answers yeah. to keep him under control. No jumpy. No bomb. jumpy. But OK, JP. Goes right in. Is he going to be able to cast the oh. ejector? He does, and I think it's going to be a first blood kill onto TOPH. Luckily, Benny Cutie was the one who got that kill. That's so, that's tough for Joan because, sure. because there's not really anything else you can find. Like, if you think about it. Okay, oh. They want to go for the stun. Look at the cables coming in. Stun? Plus the Numenum Blast, but Benny Cutie manages to stay alive. Now the counter attack for TOPH. Zyda will finish the job as brings down Chaknu. Now Omega still. No trade. Uh, they told us welcome on to JP. Are they going to be able to finish him off? Spear of Destruction will connect. Jome is in the picture right now, but the first man down is oh, okay. Or you manages to stay alive. Look at Sanford with the Primal Wrath. Zyda brings down Chaknu. Again, still no trade for Omega. Zyda. Wants... On the rest of the team going to be able to spot them out. Okay, they told us welcome once again, plus the flicker combination. But is it going to be enough to bring down JP? Because so far, he's still here. He has to use the flicker to walk What's away. Up? But look at the, look at the Numenum Blast coming in. But the first man down still is JP. Ryota still alive, but Sanford says no one for one trade. Ryota and JP will fall down. They're not yet done because Zyda right oh, now Zyda. has the Finch boys. Can actually go down right after Chakno. Tempest of Blage manages to escape the Spear of Misery as he's your heart. They try to bring down Chakno here. A killing spree coming in from oh, Zyda. Sanford not yet done. Earth Chatter combination, but Joe manages to walk away safe. One oh. member down for Omega. Dude, they're falling behind. JP again. Oh, another ejector play. Joe manages to escape. But Zyda with the Tempest of Blades to bring him down. 0 2 2 for Big J. Not Zyda surveying the scene here. I think they have to give it. Because five members of uh, TLPH is here. Adorio oh, goes in. But Goodbye. JP, look at the catch. <laughs> that was a fly. Game and so far, TLPH the Cavalry has done a wonderful oh. job. And JP with the throw. Going to be able to sustain it, manages to catch someone, but Zyda finishes him off as they work on oh. the middle lane turret and Sanford with another setup here. Jack New has to use the Numenum Blast just to delay, but Andoryu manages to catch Zyda. That's a one for one trade, but the problem is the. Just with a little, you know, showing, he's going to zone them out. It's a, good to play. Find it out. it's a good good seal play from JP. But the missile experts are here. Unstoppable force as Zyda gets the Lord. JP is going to fall down, but here comes Sanford with a primal wrath. Chakno is the next man down. Oh. Wants to go right after Ryota. He has to flicker away. Three members are left, and Sanji finishes off Ryota. And Doru. Oh, look at this. And Doru still locked on, but Sanford with the onward combination. What can you do? Uh. JP. Again, Concealed Play is going to be here. They're going to push it in. Okay, they have to deal with the Lord plus the five members of TLPH. Earth Shatter combination from Sanford is here. Ryota manages to catch Daytona's welcome. But look at that. Dominator's Descent will be casted as well as well as the Primal Wrath. Chaknu dishing out the Guardian's Barrier. Uh, oh no! Chaknu's the first man down as well as Andoryu. Jom has to walk away as TLPH works on the Crystal. A triple for Zyda and a sweep for TLPH. And you can hear it once again. Let's go.